Scott has issued his first veto of the year. It came last night over a wide-ranging bill regulating toxic chemicals in children's toys, known as S-103. The veto means the bill returns back to the Senate and then to the House. Scott calls the bill a job killer because it imposes new regulations on children's products beyond those just passed a couple of years ago. The bill would also make it easier for individuals to sue, requires testing of drinking water wells, and requires health department notification about certain chemicals in consumer products. Scott wants some sections of S-103 removed. The House Speaker says he's siding with industry lobbyists. S-103 is a really reasonable step um, that engages the administration and the health department that tries to just set a baseline to make sure that Vermonters health is protected um, where, where manufacturing and business interests are concerned. Now state house leaders could try to override the governor's veto or make changes to S-103 the governor wants instead. Too soon to know, Senate Leader Tim Ash said today.